Okay, so our highest note. Come and come and behold him. Come. That note is the. Here's middle C. So that note is. There's a couple notes below middle C. This is C octave register four. B octave register three. B flat octave register three. A octave register three. A flat octave register three. G octave register three. So <clears throat> we want the highest note that we sing right now, that being a G three, a G octave three. We want that highest note to be in middle C for males. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to count the difference between this note, G th octave 3, and C octave 4, or middle C. So how many notes is that between here? We have, I'm going to add one note, G sharp. I'm going to add two notes to the G, A, three notes, A sharp, four notes. B octave three, five notes. C middle C. So there's five notes in between here. One, two, three, four, five. And here, middle C. We want our highest note that we sing to be middle C. So that means that according to this calculation, I need to add five notes to my song key. The song key signature was in C major. Oh come, all ye faithful, joyful and triumphant. Oh come ye, oh come ye to Bethlehem. So I'm playing it in the song of, in the key of C major, and I need to add five notes. One, two, three, four, five. Five notes from my highest note that I sing in G in the middle C. So let's start that in C key signature is C. Let's add five notes to that. So next up from that we have C sharp or D flat. That's plus one. Okay. Plus two is D major. Plus three is D sharp major. D sharp or E flat major. Plus four. What is that four? We got one, two, three, four. E major. <clears throat> okay, we add our fifth note. It's going to be F. F. So the optimum song key for the song O Come All Ye Faithful is in the key of F. <clears throat> so let's test that out. 